in a mass casualty event, how do you decide which patients receive immediate care first? This one's a game changer for disaster triage. Think you know it? Stick with us till the end to see if you got it right. Don't forget to hit subscribe to Yes, You Can for more Rapid Fire and CLEX prep. We've got another hot shot. Rapid Fire questions and answers on public health, emergency response, and disaster management. Let's go. Question 1. A bioterrorism attack with inhaled anthrax exposure has occurred. What's the priority treatment? I'll give you a second. The answer is 4-ciprofloxacin or doxycycline ASAP. Early antibiotic therapy is crucial. Question 2. During a hurricane evacuation, which group should be transported first? Think fast. Patients on ventilators or needing life-sustaining equipment must go first. Electricity and oxygen are non-negotiable. Question 3. A nurse is working in a disaster shelter. What's the most important public health intervention? Let's see if you got this. The answer is infection control. Hand hygiene, sanitation, and isolation for illness prevent outbreaks in close quarters. Question 4. What is the primary goal of decontamination after chemical exposure? This one's critical. The answer is to remove the agent ASAP, strip clothing, wash skin with soap and water, and prevent secondary exposure. And back to our first question. In a mass casualty event, how do you decide which patients receive immediate care first? The answer is to use the START triage system. Treat red tag patients first. These are critically injured, but have a chance of survival with immediate intervention. Did you get them all right? Subscribe to Yes. You can. For more hot shots and next gen NCLEX mastery.